Hey, how's it going everybody? Long time no see. I found out that there's a new update, so that's what we're playing. Um, I read a little bit about it. We're gonna go out into the world, we're gonna go exploring, you guys will see my first reaction to a lot of these new things. Um, and just, fun fact, how old do you guys think this world is? Leave it in the comments, take a guess, and then I'm just gonna tell you right now, so it is over 3,400 days old. This world was created February 2nd, 2014, which was, I think, eight or nine years ago at this point. Last time I jumped on, I think I was working over here, right? I think I was working on expanding our inventory system, and I actually still have to do that. But it's funny, because you can see, these are the items from the last update. So, I've been working on updating my inventory system for the last update. Well, now there's a whole new another update, so... Um, yeah, I don't... <laughs> I'm a little behind. Um, but let's go ahead and stick this stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and shut up for a minute. Let me gather a bunch of things so we can go exploring. Okay, I think I've got everything that I need in my ender chest over here. This is Silk Touch. I think we're basically good to go. Let's run over here. Grab a couple more rockets for the way. Grab a few more carrots. What are these again? Oh, that's XP. I don't need that. But let's grab a few more totems. That's for sure. Um, I don't... So there wasn't like any new dungeons or enemies released, not to my knowledge. So I don't think I'll need it. I'm going to bring it with me just in case. Okay, here we go. Okay, so I know there are new things in the desert. Curious to see if we can just find one right now. I'm not going to spoil it, even though this, this update came out like a couple weeks ago. And I'm just kind of a big old dummy. But, yeah, I don't know. I'm usually fairly good about keeping up with Minecraft, but... I have to say that I probably haven't been this disconnected to Minecraft ever. I think in the past 10, almost 10 years of playing this game, I've always kept up with it to a, you know, a fair amount. But in the past couple months, I've definitely very much let go of Minecraft. Um, and not because I wanted to or anything like that. It's just, you know, other things took over my life. Um, but yeah, it's weird. Having an update come out, you know, a major update come out, <clears throat> you know, almost like two weeks ago, and me not even know about it, I just found out you guys are going to make fun of me, <clears throat> because a mumbo jumbo video, you know, I, w I went on YouTube and he posted a video about the new update, I'm like, oh, there's a new update? <laughs> Alright. There it is. There it is. That's what we're looking for. The camel. You guys good? So, brand new mob, the camel. Also, let me turn up my volume. So, this is basically a horse, but two people can ride on it. It does cute things like sit down. Um, I need cactus, I'm pretty sure. Let's run up over here. Let's grab, let's grab a cactus. I think this is how you... Oh, what up, spider jockey? What's good? I think this is what you need... To make it happy it's breedable I know it's breedable you can make baby camels this is what you feed it right yeah now how am I supposed to take you back home buddy um but yeah there it is you know what I'll try to do for now I'm gonna leave it here because I'm also uh, already 3,000 blocks away I'm gonna leave it here we're gonna try to find maybe a closer camel at some some point a closer camel so it's a little easier for me to take home with me okay so we need to get ourselves a brush to get a brush we need some of this let's go ahead and break this up now we need a feather so we'll have to hunt a Ooh, spooky noise we'll have to hunt the chicken down all right maybe in here question mark oh there's an alley in here Okay, hold on. <laughs> this is another thing. I've never gotten a laze. Okay, so it looks like... um, ooh. I want to bring... 
no you didn't bud yeah a laser something new uh well not i know these are not new to the update but they're just new to me and i need to give them an item right i don't know what you want oh i literally just right click okay now because i did that will you follow oh look at you don't you dare shoot at my new family. Yo, Alay. You did? Both of you? Alright. Well, let's go. Now, I know I can't fly too fast. Maybe if I'm bringing the Alay back with me, i just also bring the camel back. Because I have to go slow either way, right? Alright. Oh, he's slow, ain't ya? Oh, lord, this guy is slow. Okay. Like, that's, like, way too slow, right? Oh. What's with this weird charge? Okay. Ooh, there's a horn. Well, I think that's another new item. Not new in the update, but just uh, new to me. Alright. My two buddies, this is now home. Let me grab some glass and let me entrap them. <laughs> Sounds terrible. Let me entrap them f in, for now and just Give him a place to stay. Alright, there we go. Managed to get both of them in there. Very nice. Okay, so now we have Tuale. Chillin'. Got ourselves a little goat horn. Very nice. Okay, the other thing we got to do now is make a chisel. So I forgot what order this was in. Oh, okay, apparently that's it. Feather, copper, thing. Okay, we got ourselves two more brushes. There we go. Do we have like a trash bin? Okay, this is... Yeah, I don't want... That's not my trash bin. Oh, why don't we put them in our automatic sorting device? Wow, look at me. Um, Non-sortable items. Oh, okay, we put them in here. Let's go ahead and do that. Bang, bing. There we go. Now, I won't make the same mistake as last. Are the, is that both of the lays inside each other? Won't make the same mistake as last time. Let me grab a couple of leads. Yo, this is new. What? This. You made a creepy noise. I want to kill you. I think I might need a pair of shears for that. Right, let's see what I got. Got shears with me. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's the one. What type of wood is this? Oh, is this the mangrove? Oh, okay, see this is not new, but it's moot it's new to me. Okay. Interesting, and this is mangrove wood, mangrove roots, mangrove leaves. Oh, what is what is this stuff? This is man. Oh, this is just mud. Okay. All right, where is there mangrove trees? And this is new to me too now. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, this is a this was a brand new biome added in the last update. So not this update. But as far as I'm concerned, it's basically new. Is there nope, this is still just the roots. But I think more than likely that's <gasps> it's a freaking frog. Oh my god.
Oh my god, you're coming with me. You're beautiful. But I'll never let you go. Alright, we gotta find it. We've gotta find another frog though. I I'm like Noah. I want two of everything. There we go. Okay. It took a while to find some more frogs. I'm gonna grab as many as I can. Inevitably I'm gonna lose a couple. All right, slowly but surely, we're bringing some frogs home. These are, once again, also new to me. But, you know, again, because I haven't played this long, every single one of these mobs I have to bring back home with me eventually, right? So, I don't know. This is, like, I'm sure this is very weird for you guys in a new 1.20 update video for me to start collecting frogs. But, hey, I got to do this eventually, right? All right, there's my big old titan wall. Yeah, I love always basically knowing where my base is because some of the stuff is so massive, it's uh, almost hard to miss. If I miss my base, I, I need to get my eyes checked. All right, well, we have made it. Now we just got to do the easy part. We just got to... <laughs> get across the entire database but yeah while i'm here this is what i was talking about when i when i was ta talking about the enclosures right so we have our rabbits we have our foxes it's still behind me we have our panda bears we have our goats we have our mushrooms we have our polar bears so i will now have to create basically an exhibit for the camels and the frogs and maybe the allays the allays are a little weirder in the sense that i don't know it's not like an animal it's more of like a utility pet like i guess the same way i don't create an exhibit for a dog or a cat i don't know why i would create one for an allay okay everybody just like that we have our next mob. There we go. Can we squeeze y'all in here? I don't think you guys won't. These guys don't like suffocate themselves, do they? I sure hope not. I can jump. All right, there we go. There's our frogs. So we got lay frogs. Basically everything that I wasn't trying to get. I'm trying to get camels. Ooh, that's another pretty interesting structure over there. Maybe. Ooh, foxes. Anyone remember the what does the fox say meme? I'm sure we all had a hearty chuckle back in the day. Alright, please tell me y'all got one of those camels up in this piece really is this is this like a is this a terracotta village or something like what's up one camel we will need a second well first things first camel number one all right here's your snack all right, let's get going, buddy boy. We got a little distance. And I got to go to a dinner really soon. So I actually don't... I was hoping to have much more time to play. Doesn't look like that's going to be the case. Okay, everybody. There we go. There is our camel. So, we only got one. We do need a second. So, technically, the search isn't off. We still do need another sand monument I'm like kind of on crunch time now to go to dinner but let's go ahead and see if we got anything interesting in here oh, get that dune armor oh my god that's what I'm looking for 
All right, so there we go. That's technically one of the things that I came out here to explore for. So we're going to go ahead and play with that once we get back. For now, scout. I'm trying to scout another village really, really quickly before I have to do the dash and get to my wife's house for Din Din. That's what we're looking for. Alright, so... You have a piece of cactus, we'll breed it, and we'll go, we'll start the long process of walking it back. This one's got to go a little farther than the other one, but got to do what we got to do. Okay, everybody, and that is it. Here we go. We got our two camels, so now I think we'll be able to breed them. We got our LAs, we got our frogs. All right. Time to... Oh, and we got these smithing templates. You know, we'll stick... You know, maybe we'll just hold on to them. Um, so we do have those to play with, but again, we're going to do it once I get back home. All right, we're back from dinner. So we got these smithing templates. Now, I'm pretty sure you use those when you upgrade your diamond armor. So let's grab a couple of diamonds here. Got plenty of diamonds chilling about to the volume down a little bit sheesh all right let's see what we can do here let's get some diamonds rolling here's my question can i trim let's say my pants oh all right okay i understand okay well i totally wasted um <laughs> a bunch of these diamonds but uh, oh well happens okay noted okay so then I, here's what i think i want to do let's go and put this netherite back i don't need you i want some gold trim well here let's do this let's grab one two three four maybe let's grab one block of this one two three four and then yeah maybe we could do a diamond diamond let's see what it let's see what it would look like here so let's go and take this these pieces off i think what would be the best maybe the helmet oh hold on i need to break these apart into their individual parts okay let's put a helmet here oh we gotta put the dune thing there Okay, so we can actually see how we would look. Huh. Oh, okay. I, I'm thinking... I think the gold does look the best. I think the gold does look the best. Now, I know these can be replicated with diamonds, right? So if I put this into here, I do this. Alright, I think I I understand. I need sandstone. So where do I keep my sandstone? But I also need more diamonds. So let's go ahead and grab. We're kind of running through a couple of diamonds here, but my thing is I want to make sure that I have an extra of the dune at all times. So I'm going to make an extra. Okay. I don't think it matters what type of sandstone I have, so let's just grab a little bit. All right, so let's make some extras before we use them. Right, so if we go in here, we put the sandstone here. Oh, actually, let's make the diamonds first. And we do we do this, right? Put the sandstone and the dune. Yep. Does that make two? Oh, no, it just makes... Yeah, it just makes another one. So as you can see, now we have four of the smithing dune armor. Okay. So let's apply the dune to our armor right now. Okay. Now I think we're we're gonna go ahead and go with the gold. Yeah, I think we're gonna go ahead and go with the gold here. Hopefully I'm not like wasting this, but yeah. Here we go. Gold. Alright, and then we have one dune armor left over, which we're basically going to save in case we need to, you know, duplicate it. 
Right, let's put the bad boys on. How are, how are we looking? All right, that's looking crispy. I feel like I need to change my skin for it to be blue, right? <laughs> um, you know what? I'm curious. Okay, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna do a little something, a little funky here. Okay, everybody, here we go. We got a new skin up and running that should probably fit with our armor just a little bit better. Here we go. Bop. All right, so that's a little bit more, you know, looks a little bit more English together. All right, so now that that's done, we got some armor trim going. Let's go back to the actual exploring. We got our camels, we got our LAs, we got our frogs. So we're looking for the... Um, the sniffer or something, but I know those got to find an eggs in ocean monuments. So, Ooh, I actually got a trident from one of these guys. Oh, that's nasty. Actually, I've been uh, I've been like looking for a trident. For some reason for me, they're just kind of hard to come by. So that's actually kind of sick. Well, that's the big one. Well, I'm going to kill you. For fun, basically. Thank you. Oh, hey, we got his head, too. Sick. Oh, there's the other one. Alright, let's go and kill the other one while we're here. Why not? Screw it. Don't run away from me, you big turd. Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going, bud? Alright. Oh, yeah. That door is where it's at. Alright, so I just need to wait the four minutes. Okay, everybody. I came back home real quick. Let's just drop some... What are these? Oh, potion of night vision. Is that a new texture? That is a new texture, I think. Okay, let's just drop some of these things off that I randomly got. So I think we just have to check these types of places right here. I guess we have to look for suspicious sand. So, I'm not like super, super sure how to look for it. Other than, I guess we just gotta see this, right? Oh, and of course, oh, hopefully my mining fatigue doesn't mess with this. I don't think it does, though. Okay, see, so I just got a random wooden hoe. Okay, so I have to look around to places like this. There we go, a couple more pieces of the sand. Let's see what we got up in this piece. Give me some good. Oh, bless me. Sand. That's it? Alright. Okay, this is my game's lagging a little bit, it seems. Well, hopefully we find something good out of something. That's just another piece of coal. So, can I kind of tell what's coming out? Like, does it kind of like... It's, is it always going to look like coal, or... Okay. More ruins. Give me some sand. Okay, is that just leather boots? No, that is a angler pottery shard. Okay, so that is some of the new archaeology stuff. Okay, I think it's just another piece of coal. Okay. Well, we got one of the things we were looking for. Some form of, really any form of a shard. What is that? Is this another hoe? I don't need no hoe. This is suspicious. I think that's just another hull, right? Yeah. You don't question. Okay, here's what I want to know. Okay, I think that's another... Is that a gold nugget? Okay. Can we silk touch these suspicious sands? I want to wait until I get something that's obviously coal. Okay, I think that's a gold nugget. So let's see. Silk touch... Bro, are you serious? I'm trying to do science right now. You want to back up? If I silk touch this, 
No, it just breaks. Okay. Alright, let's try to get all the suspicious sand in the area. Is that another shard? Bro, you guys gotta be kidding me. You guys wanna back up? Don't you have anything better to do with your lives? There we go. Pretty sure this is a shard right here. Oh, yeah. Shelter shard. Okay, let's throw away these useless things out. Here. Oh, yeah. It's another pottery shard. Now, yeah, I guess my next... Where'd it go? It's a gold nugget. I don't need a gold nugget. Take more vase stuff, though. Let's see what we got here. Let's kill these two, because I feel like they're going to interfere. Get out of my way. I'm trying to find some sniffer eggs. I think it's another... Uh, okay, it's another pottery piece. You know, I guess I'm not mad with the pottery pieces, but... I want the egg... Ooh, there's a lot of suspicious pieces. Okay, here we go, here we go. Another try. Oh, I got excited. This is the stupid gold nugget. I don't need a gold nugget. Right. Quick, quick little temple. Any, any dune? Nope, nothing. All right. All right. Another ruin, another chance. Oh, yo, that's it, that's it, that's it right there, that's it. Oh, that's what we're looking for, sniffer egg. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, I'm excited. So, we really just need two of those. Once we get that second one, we can just start breeding them. But we do need at least two to start off with. And they breed with those torchlight things that we ended up getting while we were out one of the initial times. So let's just go ahead and kill these. And then, I don't know, maybe we can get super lucky and just get like a two for one. Um, no, that's a piece of coal. I was like, maybe we can hit that, hit that double. What in the world is that? Oh, that's just an iron axe. Yeah, that's exactly what we're looking for, though. So we're looking for them that sniffer egg right there. Alright, and then we gotta throw... Let's throw some things out already. Don't need that. Don't need that. Alright, let's go ahead and just grab some... Wait, what am I doing? I have doors with me. Why don't I just step in a door? You can eat. And there's another one right there, so... But yeah, so I can't really leave until I get two of these. Once I get two, then we can go home because we can breed them. But until then, got to keep searching here. Nothing. Now we'll search inside of these just because. Why not? Everything here. Right, let's take a crack at this one. Oh, oh my God. Oh, okay, sorry for that absolutely weird noise, but I'm just mostly happy that we got it, because I gotta go to sleep soon. I gotta work at 4 in the morning. Oh, I'm just glad we got it. Okay, we can now basically leave happy today at least, but let's see what time is it. Eh, 9.42. Okay, everybody, just while we're out and about, I think I figured out how to make the pottery shards, so... Let's take a look to see if I can do it. So if I put something like this, yeah, I get a decorated pot that has four designs on each side, right? So that's pretty sick. Now what happens if I silk touch it? Oh, okay, it just comes apart. Now, can I break it in the other direction? Okay, no, I can't break it in the other direction. Okay. Well, this is what we got for this one, just four shelters. But of course we have different designs, so like we can do, what is this, angler? We can mix and ma match designs, of course I'm making it the same one on both of these vases. Okay, and they're actual individual 
entities too because they're technically i think they have different ids because you know if one side has changed it becomes technically a whole new item but anyway that is what you do with those shards which is honestly pretty cool i think those are probably well i see i like items that are hard to get right harder to get than normal it seems like such a small item with not a lot of use but just the fact that it's slightly harder to get makes that item almost look cooler because it's just slightly harder to get oh that's what i'm talking about yeah baby so what i was looking for was the was whatever this cherry this looks like this looks like the absolute smallest cherry blossom biome ever what is this called yeah the cherry grove absolute smallest one we could find but look at this cherry log how beautiful that is look at this pink wood no, uh, this isn't something i'd ever use personally but um i can appreciate the addition so let's grab what we have right here um yeah this is pretty cool um i like it cherry blossom is like one of my favorite smells i think it looks really pretty obviously the whole japan thing is pretty litty um so anyway yeah this is really what i wanted to look for the last like big thing that i wanted to look for now i know there's more stuff in the update um but really this was the major stuff was the sniffers the vases and this new biome and look how broad it's down dude wait do these cherry blossoms if i like place this like over here does it like does it like have particles Ooh, what is this an actual oh my god all right i have to grab some right if this stuff like emotes <laughs> or has particles emotes was the wrong word i need to grab a lot of this stuff because this is pretty as crap i want this all over my base all right i'll just grab however much i can i'm sure i'll be able to you know find more of these this was this is very very random just chilling on top of a hill can I pick up this stuff? Okay. Oh, can I just do it with my arm? Let's pick up all of this stuff, too. I don't know if I can grab more... If I can grow more trees from this stuff. Let's grab... What is this stuff? Pink petals? Okay. Well, either way, this is all very pretty. And I appreciate it. Um, so, yeah, we got the wood. We got the grass with the thing. With, like, the particles. And we got the petals. It's all very, very pretty. All right, let's. My elytra is kind of dead anyway. Let's go ahead and head back and try to get those sniffer eggs up and running, huh? Okay, these sniffers are fairly large, aren't they? I feel like I'm gonna need something probably bigger to contain them. Oh uh, yeah, spruce fence that works. Now let's actually hatch these over here, since we have. Oh, oh this is like not good. No, I don't wanna. Maybe we can hatch them right here. How about right here? I feel like this is a good good spot right out right out in the open let's go bang and bang Ooh, those are some big old eggs and then let's grab some fences just go and do this and in due time they'll hatch and it'll be beautiful so here's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go ahead i'm gonna like afk basically right here I'm going to go do some laundry and stuff, and I'll be back. They're supposed to hatch in like 10 minutes. All right, everybody. So I just got home from work. It's the next day, and my sniffers have spawned. Now, I know they need to probably be on grass to find stuff, so I trapped them in here to hatch, but I might actually just take them outside. I think there's a bit of grass over here. Is this, like, hollow? No, it's not. Okay. I don't know what land is fake and what's not at this point because... My world is like Michael Jackson. It's had so much work done on it that it's like hard to tell sometimes. So you know what? Let's just for now give them this much room. Hmm? To you too, bud. All right. You know, y'all can come out this way, huh? Yeah, come out. Y'all can come chill out here with me. Can I like push you out? Aren't you like? Attracted to the grass, my boy. That's right. Go out there. Go out there. Hey. Hmm. Come on, bro. I got some fresh, 
fresh, juicy, juicy grass out here for you. You just gotta come and get it, alright, bud? Come on. Come on, come on, come on. It's time for you to go outside. Come on, man. Go out and play. Don't spend all your time inside. It's bad for your bones, bud. There you go. You know you like it. You know you like it. That's not something I should repeat. Um. There we go. Where's my co black concrete? That's what I want to do. I'm going to place these two right here. Here and here. I'm going to do that. Bang, bang. Um. Yes, these are vases. With the cherry wood. So I, I guess I just wanted to mostly show you guys some stuff we can do with it. Um. So it can be obviously just used as wood. We can have doors, stuff like that. So let's build a door. And then we could do that. What else can we do with it? Give me some, give me some more. Um, we can have all the buttons. Ooh, the chiseled bookshelves. So that's another new thing with the with these bookshelves. So now these bookshelves are kind of customizable. Do we have books here? Do I not have books? Well, you can like put certain books in the shelf to you know. Do I really not have a book here? I can here. I'm gonna steal this one. So as you can see, you can now place books in in the different areas, which is pretty cool. And we can do this with enchanted books and everything. So these are more customizable now, which is fairly fairly nice. Um, yeah, we got these doors. We got planks. We got a boat. I think boat, which is pretty pretty nasty here. Um, just gonna take this stuff down. Goat horn. Is that one? Of the oh yeah. Well, I got the goat horn, which is again not particularly new as far as an update, but um, what else in here? Oh, I I wanted to see these cherry. Oh, and these. I guess I can play with these. So I found out basically. Oh, I have to place these on grass, don't I? I right, thank you, Strad. With these. You can actually be very creative with these. I didn't even realize until I watched like Etho's video that these are basically placed in corners. So when you place it, it's always put in the bottom right corner. So you can end up actually making words and designs with these. You know, if you know how to use them correctly. So let's just say like, you know, I want to do... I don't know. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not an artist, but point is, Google it. You can actually uh, do some pretty cool stuff with these. Now, here's what I wanted to know. These cherry leaves. I saw that inside of the biome, there was these, you know, cherry blossom particles. I want to just test. Again, this is all just testing. Oh, I'm going in the wrong direction. Do those particles always spawn under the leaf? And if they do, how far down do they travel? Now, for the sake of not farther furthering the mess that is my current base i'm actually gonna run over here also i need to re-download optifine i know you don't have to tell me oh and i should probably move these beacons over towards my new base i didn't even realize that oh yeah all my beacons are over here this door still works right okay yeah the door still works i actually had to fix it um hint, hint or secret secret i actually did have to fix it okay so let's just say we come over here yeah, okay. They do drop stuff. But they don't drop very far. Hmm. These just break, right? Yeah, we we'll need a pair of shears. Okay, well, I'm curious. If I just, like, fill up the room, how much, how much leafage is going to happen here? Let's just place everything we got for now. And just kind of see how how the effect is. See, that's so cool. I like that. I might try to incorporate this in some form of build. Because this is, if you guys remember, I was really fascinated with that one other plant that came with the deep caves. Because it, it had a constant, you know, particle drop. And I absolutely loved it, but they're so hard to grab. With these things, these leaves, they're, they're much easier to grab. So that has a lot of potential for me for like, you know, um, 
just something cool that I can play with because I don't know. I just love falling particles. I think I tried to do it here. Yeah, you see with these, um, I have that effect in this room now. I think, you know, the cherry blossoms are going to be a lot less than this, but I just, I love this, right? Um, I think it's just super, super cool. Okay, let's see. What, what else new can we play with here? Because um, we already played with a lot of this other stuff. This is a lot, a lot from the... And now there's a few things, like there's the calibrated skull sensors, but I'm not smart enough to deal with those. Okay, everybody, I'm kind of just out here looking for one of the trail ruins. Um, I don't... I've already been flying around for a little while now. Um, I likely won't find it at this moment. So I'm just going to take this opportunity to just go ahead and end the episode... Um, like I said, next episode we'll do a lot more stuff. Um, let's see, is there any... Ooh, okay, see? Little little gravel here. What is that? Coal? I don't want that. Get a couple more slots in here. Emerald, I don't need that. Shard? I'll take a shard. And we'll go ahead and end off the episode, but... Yeah, not gonna lie, finding this suspicious... Uh, gravel is like somewhat addicting. I just want to find more. <laughs> Alright, but guys, um, thanks for watching. Like I said, we'll uh, continue to do stuff um, in the next future episodes. Thanks for watching.